Daniel Fisher. I took lessons when I was really little. That was like my first intro to like playing guitar. A year prior to writing that song, I had this wild encounter with Jesus and uh, totally changed the way I thought about everything, totally changed all my priorities. So I started praying that prayer, being like, Lord, I'm gonna come follow you wherever. I felt like the Lord was saying, if you're gonna follow me at all, follow me now. Like, do it, do it now. Like, just come follow me. Like, didn't say where, but I knew it meant like I had to leave school and I was just like, not sure whether or not I could do that, but um, the Lord just put it on my heart really strong to do that, so I left. Part of what influenced that song a lot was, you know, Jesus like, Jesus talks more about like helping the poor, like in the New Testament and in the Old Testament, it talks about like helping the poor and like the needy more than a lot of other things that Christians deem like super important. You can't control a lion and you can't control God's son. Uh, there's a cry rising from Zion. It's the spirit and the bride saying, come. And it's just, I guess, I guess the reason I say that is because um, maybe that's the, that's the heart of the frustration I was experiencing is trying to put like a box on Jesus, trying to put like a cage on the lion from the tribe of Judah. Awake in your heart 